Well, it's January 2010, and it's the launch of uh, Crime Stoppers Month worldwide. We're at Toronto Police Headquarters here. I'm Constable Scott Mills. I'm the Toronto Crime Stoppers Youth Officer. And uh, what you're looking at is a picture of Carolyn Connolly, and uh, she's a murder victim from just down the street where we're standing here. We've got two very special uh, and distinct guests here today, and they're going to talk about a little bit what they do. Uh, Amber O'Hara is a cousin of uh, Carolyn. And uh, we've got Mr. Gary Murphy here, uh, the president of Crime Stoppers International. Amber, welcome. Thank uh, you. What's your message to the world today? My message to the world today is if you have any information about any unsolved crime, please pick up the phone and call Crime Stoppers. Thank you. Uh, thanks for all the support you've given us. And uh, is there anything that you uh, would like to say uh, about Carolyn so the world knew the person she was? Yeah, Carolyn was a mother. She had two daughters. She was a grandmother. She had a grandson, Ryan, who she adored. And her oldest daughter had just found out she was pregnant again when Carolyn was uh, stabbed to death on August 2nd, 2008. Uh, she had a heart of gold, um, helped a lot of the young girls off the street, and she didn't deserve to die like this. Thanks for talking to us, Amber, and uh, keep the strength. Um, Mr. Gary Murphy, uh, President of Crime Stoppers International, a Canadian. Um, can you tell us a little bit about how Crime Stoppers works and, and your network worldwide? Well, Crime Stoppers is a non-profit, community-based organization designed to assist the police solve unsolved crime. And it works the same way in Toronto as it does in South Africa or in the United Kingdom or Australia. Any one of the 1,200 programs that we have in about 28 countries around the world. The idea is that we have an opportunity to help the police solve unsolved crime by providing the information that the public always knows is out there. And the difference is that this way, by calling Crime Stoppers, they have the opportunity to provide that information in an anonymous manner. Now, I noticed in the, your messaging on uh, the CSIWorld.org website that uh, prevention, uh, prevention of uh, acts uh, of violence that took Carolyn here uh, is a key uh, of your portfolio and, and, and your mission. Uh, can you tell us a little bit about the prevention part? Well, as many people are aware, um, the public always has the information on many types of crimes, whether that be after the fact or in some cases before crime actually occurs. So we encourage people to call Crime Stoppers with information that will help solve a crime or if they have information that will help prevent a crime. And we're also interested, obviously, in that as well. Well, thank you very much. We appreciate both of your support, and thank you for being here on this special day in Toronto. Uh, anonymous text tips in Toronto and worldwide, smscrimetips.com is uh, where you can find out worldwide how anonymous text tips works. In Toronto, you can call 416-222-8477 or toll-free 1-800-222-TIPS, or you can go on the web at 222tips.com and leave an encrypted tip. We'll just finish off uh, with some of the posters that are on display here for some of these victims. Unsolved cases, and uh, if there are people who are left out here. It's not on purpose. Um, We want to give our heartfelt condolence to any family out there who's uh, uh, missing or has lost a family member to violence. He was my dad. You took him away from me. I'm only seven years old. Help me find his killers. Jamal Grant, sadly missed and always loved.